Persians, Persians, la la la. Bubbly bubbles, la la la. I can't believe I thought of something so brilliant. Mistress is going to be so proud of me when she gets back. I bet she won't even be upset about all the tubes and flasks I broke. Although Mittens is probably going to snitch on me, that grumpy old cat. Oh, Mittens, you're... you're here. I was just talking to myself, saying how you're such a kind and generous familiar for babysitting me while Mistress is away on business. Not that I need to be babysat. I'm an adult, for God's sake. Are you just keeping your eye on your favourite and only student, or is there something you need me for? What? There's someone at the door? It's gotta be Mistra, she's finally back! Oh my god, she's really, really back. Oh, I almost forgot. Could you please watch the cauldron for me, Mittens? I'll be so grateful if you would. There will be an extra tin of tuna in it for you. Okay, okay. Calm down. She's back finally. She'll be so happy to see me after such a long time. Welcome home, Mi- Ah! What the heck? That- That wasn't Mistress at all. Who- Who was that? God, they probably think I'm crazy. Living in a little cabin in the middle of the woods, wearing these funky robes, and to top it off, I screamed at them like a baby. How socially awkward have I become living alone out here? H hello I'm sorry about slamming the door in your face, but... Who are you? And why are you here? You're... You're bleeding. Um, come in. Let me help you to the couch. You poor boy. I hope it doesn't hurt too much, but... Don't worry, I'm a pro at fixing up bumps and cuts. It looks a lot worse than it actually is. You just got a little scratched up. Mistress always has a potion for that, let me just... Ah, here it is. Don't worry, it'll only sting for a sec. Hold my hand if you want to. There, there. It's okay. It's all over now. I know, I know. I'm sorry if it hurt too bad, but I had to. It might have been just a flesh wound, but it would have hurt a whole lot more if it got infected. You wouldn't have wanted that, would you? Oh! You don't need to say that. I'm not a hero at all. If anything, you should be thanking the mistress when she gets back. She made the potion that fixed you up, after all. My job was simple, honestly. Just apply elixir to the algae. Who's the mistress? What? You really don't know about her? I thought everyone did. She's the wisest and most powerful sorceress in the whole kingdom. That's why whenever that knucklehead king has a monster problem, he always needs a mistress to come save the day. Well, I say monster problem, but... In reality, he needs her help for everything. It's almost like he makes up reasons. I'm sorry if I'm coming across as a little aggressive, it's just... I've been living with the mistress for months now, but she's only given me basic training so far. What am I training for? Can't you tell? Seriously? Just take a look at me. Funny looking robes, even funnier looking pointy hat. There, you got it. I'm training to be a witch, but we prefer to be called sorcerers now. Witch is really old fashioned and a little burn them at the stake. <laughs> But that's enough about the mistress and me. Tell me about yourself. What made you arrive on my doorstep bleeding everywhere? Oh, come on, why not? Surely those scrapes have an interesting story behind them? It's embarrassing. Now I want to know even more. 
Pretty please. I did help you out after all. Okay, okay. I promise not to laugh. It can't be that bad anyway. I mean, I shut the door in your face and screamed like a baby not that long ago. Now that was embarrassing. You... You fought a squirrel? Why... Why would you do that? Okay. I think I understand now. Let me get this straight. You went into the woods looking for some cool rocks, but... You accidentally picked up an acorn with an evil little critter attached. I can relate, not with being attacked, but having to deal with an annoying fluffy creature. M mittens! I thought you were watching the cauldron. Has he been listening to us this whole time? He really is a tiny little demon. It's complete? Yes, my very own version is finally ready. With the help of the Enchanted Cauldron, it shall taste spectacular. <laughs> I'm sorry if I just freaked you out, but in basic training, Mistress taught me that whenever you complete a potion, you need to laugh like an idiot. Did I make something sinister? No, of course not. I'm not that advanced yet. The first lesson of witchcraft is making the most delicious meals with the use of a cauldron. You... you think that's stupid, huh? It's actually not when you think about it. Really, you learn how to safely use a cauldron, and you also get some good food. Every sorcerer needs their fuel. What did I make? I knew you'd be intrigued. I made the absolutely most tenderest chicken tenders the world has ever seen. Your stomach sounds like it likes the sound of that. If you sit at the table, I'll bring them in for us to share. Yeah, yeah, I'll bring you your tuna. I guess you wanted it after all, demonic fluffball. 